I know you don't want to talk about it, but you can't keep putting it off. You have to decide. It is a difficult thing you ask. We will close the inn to paying guests. But if we have reason to believe that God has put a stranger at our door, we will not turn that stranger away. Where are you going? I don't really have much money, so... Come. I know a place. Hi, I'm Joe. This is Bobby. We got cookies! Come on! Ah. So, Joe, what brings you to Sugar Creek? Um, just passing through. Heading home? I haven't decided. No, I know they're looking for me. That's why I left. Do you have any news? How many times do I tell you? They don't have any evidence. I know that you're trying to help, but we don't know anything about him. You don't know me. I don't blame you for being suspicious. So the only reason I don't run you out of here right now is because they have it in their heads that they're supposed to help you and your son. It's hard to believe that you two are even related. Where are you from? All over. Joe, I'm a cop. You have to answer the questions. Why? Have I committed a crime? I don't know. And your wife, what does she say? My wife died five months ago. Joe and his son are down on their luck. There is no shame in that. I think you should stay with us a while. Hmm? I wish I knew how to thank you for everything you've done. The scripture says to treat all strangers as though they were angels. I'm no angel. Be not forgetful to entertain strangers, for thereby some are angels unaware. So what happens now? Well, I've never seen an angel either, but sometimes you gotta take a chance with a regular person. I think the more you run from your troubles, the more lost you become.